All right, so today in uh, entertainment, it's all about uh, Shatawale and Yafono. <laughs> a lot of beef going on, you know. You know, you, you know I walked into, I walked into a, a Malcolm shop uh -huh. today, and, and there were some staff workers there, and they were discussing it. And the discussion was, who do you think is going to win eventually? Well, and, uh, then, and then there was one guy uh -huh. who believed that Shatawale was going to really? triumph eventually. And then there were four other guys who said, hey, you don't know. You have to know. He has a history. I mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so for those who are not familiar with this uh, beef between yep. Yafono and Shatawali, it's that I told you about the likelihood that this was going to happen, the likelihood that they were going to be beefing. After the Cape Coast show yeah. that Shatawali didn't allow Yafono to perform before him, claiming that he had waited for two hours. We saw this coming. But Shatawale came back to Accra, decided to swear this one, and go straight at Marco Kwekumante. And then Yapuno said in a, a message or a tweet, he said, OK, if you like, do a live video. If you like, say faint. And that's how, he sta that's how he started. So people kept daring Shatawale that you've been asked to say just be. No, the, 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 the fit itself is a dare. Exactly. Uh -huh. But you know, no one dares Shatawale and go scot free. So, okay, so for people who may not understand, mm -hmm. I mean, growing up, when, when we're kids, you, you typically want to dare somebody, you say, if you like, say, say fee. Uh -huh. If you like, say fee. If you say <laughs> fee, then, then it I'll beat you. Exactly. Or we'll fight. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So he said, Safe. Safe. And Shatawale, this started before the weekend. Shatawale refused to safe. At a point, there was a post with his official handle that indicated that my SM fans want me to say the word, but now I am a born again. That post was deleted not long after it was posted. Right. So we knew that Shatawale was not going to say thing. Then Yapono released Moko. Noko. It means, on your family, Noko, you can't do anything to me. In that song, he made reference to Charles Niyama. He didn't add the men's son, but of course we all knew it was that he was, was referring to Shatawali. Then Shatawali knew that it was now time to save feet. So he released a song entitled Save Feet. So in that song, he says, Save Feet. Then he says, Feet. In that song, he made reference to Yapono, asking Yapono, how can a man be called Ya? And all the lyrics of that song, that, that song, were explicit. They are not lyrics that you want so to put So it means you can Exactly. So we thought that was going to be the end. Yapono says, no, I've got a response for you. And that was the big one. Beinabu. Beinabu is like a dog's mouth. Exactly. And he had a picture that showed Shatawale's body with a dog's mouth on his face. Oh. Yes, so Benabu. So that's how bad it's gotten. Essentially, and he's saying that Shatawali's Shatawali has mouth gone. looks like a dog's mouth. So, and somebody says, before I continue, somebody says, Samini says Shatawali is baby. You know, in that song, baby in pay party. Now, this one says Benabu. What's the relationship between Shatawali and dogs? That's what somebody was asking today. But away from that, now Shatawali comes back again and says, one man killer. Oh, this is a. This is that's a, a picture. That's Benabu. That's Benabu by Yapuno. But the, the, that mouth there looks like a bulldog's mouth. Well, the why, bull, why did it the choose, bulldog has it... left him. So, well, we don't know. So now we are waiting for Shatawale to release a song because Yapuno's lyrics, even though very vulgar, where the punchlines were that heavy, only for Shatawale to come out with one man killer. And I don't know. It's also a song you can't play on radio, but everybody, all the critics, including this young man, think that it's a done deal. Shatawale is gone to sleep. Let's see this video. <coughs> That's how oh, no. creative we, we can get with things like this. So this guy has nothing to do with it. He has got nothing to do. He just went do. on, on uh, Facebook or Believes social media. Believes that Shatawale has been murdered by Yafuno, so there's a need for a phone round. But somebody else who is basking in this is Prodigal. Now, Prodigal has said constantly, even though he won't grant an interview, that he's got issues with Shatawale after the Nima concert. Yeah, where they were supposed to do a concert, yes, and then and Shatawale also had a concert at the same time. So this time. is what he posted on Instagram. Hey, Ponobium, girls, girls, you hear? Because in Yapono's Benabu, he indicated, alleged, alleged that Shatawale has got A's. 
and so the girls should be careful of him. That's how bad the lyrics were. It, they were just jabbing at each other. It was that bad. And so that's why this man is saying that, okay, you the girls, girls, girls should be you, aware. You, you, yeah. But again, two times, Arabi was one of Shatawali's you know, guys. He left him and indicated, said on Facebook Live that he doesn't believe Majesty is Shatawali's son. Yapono makes reference to that again. Arabi again today goes on Facebook to say, go do a paternity test to confirm that that young boy is your son. So it's getting, you oh, know... Oh, this is getting serious. Getting really serious that we thought, you know. We saw beefs, we've seen beefs, you've seen Shatawale Samini, you didn't get this bad. We've seen the best beef of all time, Sarko Diya Manifest. Manifest. Beautiful beef. Well, yeah, it was this lovely. One, this one looks like we're getting it's in the gutters. dirty. Gutters. Very dirty. And that's how far we've come. With Samini saying that he needs extra popcorn, cinema mode activated, oh. and that he's just watching his timeline. <laughs> and I1 and Root Boy Ranking wait in, go do a song for Shatawale. They also throwing jabs at Shatawale. So Shatawale seems to be the only man standing. Yeah. A lot of people are solidly behind Yapo. No, right. I mean, it's all right. It's like uh, Tupac. It's me against the world. Uh huh. Yeah, so, it's okay. so now what's good is that Yapono's fan base is increasing by the day. If you check his Instagram handle, it's boomed from what he used by 10,000 more followers. Wow. Yes. Both Instagram and Twitter. So it looks like it's going in favor of the Apple. And that's why a lot of people think that he's won. So you know, so, that'll be for entertainment. I'm just hoping that the Apple no, gets to release another beef track this night. Then tomorrow we've got news again <laughs> on the beef between the Apple no and Shatawali. But till then, yeah. it's a wrap. Thank you, Ms. G. Up next, we bring you Join Us Interactive. Mm -hmm.